Namaste everybody. In this video, I will show you how you can download character from Mixamo to use in your project. Without wasting any time, let's get started. Go to Mixamo.com and create an account or you can also log in with your Google account. Go to character section and choose the best to download and simply hit the download button. Change the format to FPX for Unity and select the post to be Depot and do your final download. Now it's time to get some animations for your character. Go to the animation section. Now the only thing to do is to select an animation and click download. You can also tweak settings for your animation which are right under the upload character button. Now choose FPX for Unity as format 30 frames per second without skin and uniform keyframe reduction. After doing all this, hit the download button. This was the process to download single animation. You can also download multiple animations at once. To get them, search for pack in your search box and go through this collection and find that matches your requirement. I will download this action adventure pack for now. Here I'm moving all the files to the Unity project and setting up a scene for the character. For the first step, let's unpack the textures and material of our character. Create folders for both of them. Select the character model that we downloaded at first and go to the material tab. Click export texture and select the recent folder that we created. Now do the same for the material. You may see some issues like this. It looks like the character is showing inside out. To fix this, select the material and change the rendering mode to opaque. You can do some tweaks to your material to get better results. Time to set up the model for the game. Select FBX character, go to the model tab and uncheck import cameras and light. Go to rig tab and change animation type to humanoid. Avatar definition to create from this model and hit apply. Go to animation tab and uncheck import animation because there is no animation in this model. It's done here. Let's do the same for all the animation. We are going to copy the avatar for all these animations. So choose copy from other avatar for avatar definition and select the avatar of the first FBX as source and then finally hit the apply button to finish this up. Finally, let's run a test because you may see some of the problems with animation also and you may not know how to fix them. So watch till the end to find out the actual solution for the animations. I will use idle animation for this purpose. Select your animation, go to animation tab and change the name of the animation to something you easily understand and use. Also, don't forget to assign an avatar to your animator. Now, here's the issue with animation. It's not looking to be playing the right way. To fix this, you need to make some tweakings in the animation. To be able to change this setting as required, you need to know what each of these config means. But you can also do testing and come out with the best solution. After doing things here, you are finally done. Let's have a look at the final animation. And you can see it has been fixed. This is a way how you come out with animation from Mixamo and finally use it in your game. I hope this video was helpful and you get the idea of how it is done. If you do have some questions, you can freely comment it out. I will try my best to answer you. Go below this video and subscribe to this channel because the next video is going to be about creating a climbing system in your game and I am thinking of creating tutorials for making the whole game that you may not find elsewhere and also hit the bell icon if you want to get notified when a new tutorial arrives. Thank you so much for watching this video and thank you so much for making this to end. Until next time, goodbye and take care.